Hello, let's take a look at the new Privacy IDEA 2.0. Privacy IDEA is a system to manage authentication devices for two-factor authentication. The second factor can be one-time password token, hardware or smartphone apps. Authentication can be done using SMS or email, but there are also other possibilities of using a second factor, like the old well-known SSH key. You can use Privacy IDEA to manage all those devices for the users. Privacy IDEA was written, rewritten based on Flask and SQL Alchemy for the backend and Bootstrap and AngularJS for the web UI. So let's dive in to take a first glance. This is the login to log in to the web UI to manage the devices. The same login form can be used to log in as administrator or as normal user. Let's log in as administrator. You can see a list of all tokens in the system. Each token has a serial number, a serial number, a type and several other attributes. You can click on one token to get, to get the token detail view. In the detail view, you can edit the token. And you can test the token, for example. Furthermore, we can unassign or assign a token. Let's unassign the token so that we can see the assignment process. Unassign. We can type the username we want to assign and the system finds automatically which user we are going to assign the token to. You can assign a pin and click assign user. Now the token is assigned to the user again. That was easy, wasn't it? From the token view, we can also go to view the details of a certain user. Either from the token detail view or also from the Sorry, from the token list view. Not only can we see or could we see the details of the user, but we can also see which tokens are assigned to the user. This makes it simple for the help desk if a certain user calls. Well, let's enroll a new token. We will enroll an event-based Google Authenticator. For this we click Enroll Token. We can choose which kind of token, which type we want to enroll and we can again assign the user to enroll. And we set a PIN. Finally we click Enroll Token and we are presented a QR code which we can scan with the Google Authenticator app, which will I do now. We can either enroll a new token, we can go to the user details view, or we can go to the token detail view. I will go to the token detail view. Um, now I will test the token. It was enrolled successfully. My smartphone creates a new OTP value. I click test token and the system tells me that I tested the token successfully. Perfect. The web UI will log us out after a certain idle time. Well, we did not take a look at the configuration yet or at the outer lock. All this and other stuff 
will follow in the next screen cars. Oh, we are, unfortunately, you did not see the logging out. So stay tuned. I will show you the configuration, I will show you the audit log, and I will demonstrate how a normal user is going to use this interface to manage his own tokens. Have fun, test the system, stay tuned. Bye.